two. Trucker rank two, number 41. What's up, y'all? This is about, uh, let's see, I'm trying to find a clock here. Turn my whole thing off. It's about 1048. Monday morning. Monday morning. Monday night. It wouldn't be dark out here if it was Monday morning. Uh, I've been doing some little short videos. I'm sure some of y'all have noticed. Some of you subscribers kind of noticed I've been doing some videos. Alright, um, a lot of them. Let me set this back up here. There we go. Uh, they've been, uh, some of them been radio related and trucker related. I got a new video series out called Trucker Advice. Trucker Advice. Basically, let me roll that one up that way, not hearing that motor. Basically, the trucker advice is just something that I kind of wanted to help younger drivers. You know, I don't, I felt like I've been kind of neglecting that. I mean, I kind of want to help out as much as I can. You know, some of the drivers that may need a little advice. And, you know, and quite frankly, uh, trying to help out drivers with stuff that sometimes don't get caught you know it's like you always got these drivers getting on YouTube preaching about safety and this that and other um, or uh, how to adjust to live on the road which is which are big things you know those are big things to just to live on the road and to be safe but um, some of the things that I don't see um, is you know, like advice on how to be productive, and um, and some just some just random advice. And so those videos you'll see pop up, and they'll be just like little short videos. You know, so thought I'd let y'all know that while we're here on Trucker H Two Forty One, we're just getting so old here. Okay, I've been doing videos all day. Well, I say all day. I've done two videos. I've been working all day. I just all evening. I've been doing videos, and uh, so I'm trying to get more videos up per week, you know. And because, um, like, I'm I got the uh, AdSense and I got my door open. Got the AdSense going, you know. So, like, I don't know if y'all noticed. I've got some ads up, and so make more I don't have like the thousands and thousands of millions of views that some of the other guys have got so I've got to do more more videos okay so y'all tell y'all's friends about about trucker right you and all the videos that I do uh, they will help me out anyways let me show y'all where at that's uh or I or it like that like you know I like to talk right I'm here at the Schneider yard here in um, the Dallas Dallas OC this is back in my trailer right here show y'all around here at night There's trucks getting fuel over there okay and then up there, there's a little lobby and driver services, showers in there. Ice, free ice. Man, you gotta love free ice. Morning, everybody. I just woke up. I haven't even gone to the bathroom or done anything yet. Fixing to. Well. What did I dream about? Dreamed about some woman trying to get me fired because of diabetes or something like that. And that don't happen. 
you know, people don't want to fire you because of diabetes. Usually the way that works is that you have a, take a DOT physical every two years. And if your blood sugar is too high, you wind up with diabetes, though. You know, a lot of times you, you, you can't pass the DOT, and, you know, physical. That's how you lose your job. I'm sitting there thinking, it, it's just so hard to be healthy out here on the road. Any drivers out there know it's extremely hard. And I think what we ought to do out here and we could use YouTube as a good tool for this. Um, is to kind of hold each other accountable. But like maybe have a uh, like a diet plan or something, you know? It's like everybody on YouTube that watches these videos and stuff should all try to do something to help each other out. Like, you know, what do you do to stay in shape? I will tell you this, is that it is extremely hard for me to come out here and eat healthy. And do exercise and stuff like that. Most drivers gain weight. I gain weight. And that's, you know, that's really while we have problems with diabetes and high blood pressure and it kills us you know and I don't want to die at an early age I don't think anybody does so let's um, all kinda get together help each other out I'm gonna start little by little on these videos just kinda showing you maybe what I'm doing and then if some of y'all have ideas or videos, send them to me and send them out, put them out, whatever. That's something that we all should be very interested in as drivers is, you know, holding each other accountable, you know. I like to sleep with my windows or my curtains like this. Actually, actually, when I parked here, the sun was was uh, going down over there. So, so yeah, I like curtains. I just woke up. I'm really not a morning person, so I'm putting a fake smile on my face. I'm gonna go wake up. You know, overnight was about 60s, low 60s. I would usually say that that's good weather, and it is. I would. I don't know about these other drivers. I don't. All night. All night. Now, I don't know what you like to do, but, uh, I mean, guys are just idling. I mean, you realize how much fuel that takes up idling? Yeah. You know, have a little air blowing through, there's nothing. You know, you know, it feels good, you know don't cost you anything for when it's 61 degrees all right well I don't know I guess if it was their money they wouldn't idle uh, I just like fresh air being that I'm in South Dallas though it's not too fresh um, let's see here what were we talking about I went to go eat breakfast sorry I didn't take y'all in there went to go eat breakfast I'm putting these on to hide my my sleepy eyes. <clears throat> I went to go eat breakfast, and um, I had sitting there talking about diets and whatever. 
I had biscuits and gravy, just one biscuit and gravy on top of it and a piece of sausage. I guess that's bad. The biscuits and gravy. You know, one of these days, people are going to say, hey, those truck drivers are in bad condition. How about we have them an option to have a healthy meal for breakfast, lunch, and dinner? Um, this is quite easy to do. Um, basically, lean meats and white meats are very healthy. And low in calories, low in carb. I mean, I don't know. You, know, you think carbohydrates are the worst thing we could eat out here because if you eat complex carbohydrates within reason those are really used and when I was really in shape I would use the complex carbohydrates for my energy I would like eat that before workout um, now we eat just the bad carbs everything bad no workout and and that's all there is out here, all this bread and stuff. They don't even offer us wheat bread, you know. I'm sure wheat bread is a little bit more expensive, but I'll pay a little bit more for the wheat bread. I'll pay a little bit more for grilled chicken, grilled fish, uh, turkey meat, you know, a lot of this stuff that a lot healthier for us. Um, I just, you know, it's not entirely the driver's fault because we don't have the options out here and um, I think restaurants and big trucking companies should get on board with helping keeping their drivers healthy and there's several ways to do that but as from a driver I'm not a restaurant owner I'm not a company owner I can get out here and use YouTube to you know let's help each other out because I, I don't want to have a big gut I'd like to be about a 220 pounds I'm six foot four okay so I'm a I'm a big guy um, and 220 is probably the skinny for too skinny for me maybe 230 240 you know I, I, I was down that way not too long ago so um, let's 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 do this y'all let's um, cut out all these Dr. Peppers I'm gonna try to cut out now I haven't bought Dr. Peppers to keep here in the truck in about two weeks um, but it's these uh, you know during places you know restaurants and stuff that you know I just say drink Dr. Pepper you know and I don't think one or two it's going to hurt. But man, I was drinking Dr. Peppers like crazy. I'm a Dr. Pepper man, and I love Dr. Peppers. It's a nice, sweet drink. So let's do this, guys and girls. Let's, um, and if y'all have ways to get out here and, and you know, if y'all got good ideas, share them, please. We could use it all. And, and all the the good ideas that I you know get from from you that I will find helpful for me I will relay that information onto my videos like I probably put it on my trucker advice videos and um, maybe or maybe truckers die. I may have like a whole new series, Truckers Diet. I don't know what it is about truckers I like in my, my title. I got Trucker Rag Chew, Bonehead Truckers, Trucker Advice. I mean, now Trucker Diet. I mean, I guess. I don't know. I like the word trucker or truckers out here. And you should be proud of it. Don't let the people at the general public think that, that you're a low human being. I'm not. I mean, I've got a lot of pride in what I do. And I think everyone else should. Don't be, a, you know, uh, be embarrassed of who you are. Be proud of it. Well, the sun is coming up for another day. Today is Tuesday, 
October the 11th. Yeah. So, another day. Trucker rag shoot number 41. Sorry it wasn't like, like really thought out. It was just a bunch of me running my mouth. But, anyways, thanks for watching. 73.